Chris, I'm curious. What are your favorite use cases for DLCs as an entrepreneur? Um, well, I'm really excited about what a team in, out of Canada is building, Atomic Finance. Uh, right now, they're working on uh, making it. Uh, giving the ability for users to earn yield on their hodlings for Bitcoin in a non-custodial way. So, you know, most people that own Bitcoin right now, um, especially if they want to make sure they retain custody, you know, put their Bitcoin on, you know, a piece of paper or a hardware wallet or on, you know, very dark place somewhere that the Bitcoin's super secure. Um, unfortunately, that doesn't allow you to, uh, use your Bitcoin to gain yield on it and keep accruing value and putting your capital to work. Um, Atomic Finance is working on a product that allows hodlers to sell covered call options for Bitcoin. So basically how this would work with a DLC is uh, one party puts up the premium to purchase the option in Bitcoin. The other party puts up the full for round numbers. We'll just call it one Bitcoin. That can be transferred to the uh, option purchaser contingent upon an oracle signature. So, um, to walk us through an example, let's just say, uh, Nadav is looking to purchase an option. I am a hodler of Bitcoin and I'm looking to, uh, you know, make some yield on my Bitcoin. Um, we'll just say our theoretical strike price for the option is 100k. And now what this means is um, if the oracle that me and the dog chooses broadcasts that the price is over, uh, Bitcoin price is over 100K at the maturity date, um, the dog can exercise his option and take my one Bitcoin of hodlings that he purchased in exchange for the premium uh, of the option. Now, if the Bitcoin price is under 100K, I would just get to keep the premium of the option uh, that Nadav put up front for uh, the right to purchase that Bitcoin if it was over 100k. So, and all this is done in a shared custodial way or non-custodial way. Um, me and Nadav, we're in the two of two multi-sig for the duration of the option. We're waiting for the Oracle to purchase, uh, to broadcast the price at the expiration. And then depending upon what the price is, we, um, you know, have the Bitcoin go one way or the other way, depending on what the outcome is. But uh, again, the powerful concept here is it allows people to start earning interest or yield on their Bitcoin hodlings without throwing it into some sort of uh, uh, not or some some sort of custodial platform like BlockFi here in the United States. So I I think that has the potential to be a very popular product, um, especially amongst uh, Bitcoin hodlers that are security and privacy uh, sensitive.